post hoc test is to be performed only after ANOVA test has been conducted, and on basis of ANOVA test, the null hypothesis has been rejected. A post hoc test is used only after we find a statistically significant result and need to determine where our differences truly came from. The term post hoc comes from the Latin for after the event. The main post hoc methods to test the means after experimentation are Bonferroni method, 2K's honestly significant difference, HSD test, Fisher's least significant difference, LSD test. This multiple comparison post hoc correction is used when we are performing many independent or dependent statistical tests at the same time. The problem with running many simultaneous tests is that the probability of a significant result increases with each test run. This post hoc test sets the significance cutoff at AN, AER significance level. For example, if we are running 20 simultaneous tests at a significance level, this dual of 0.05, the correction would be 0.025. More detail. The Bonferroni does suffer from a loss of power. This is due to several reasons, including the fact that type 2 error rates are high for each test. In other words, it overcorrects for type 1 errors. 2K's honest significant difference, HSD, is a very popular post hoc analysis. This analysis, like Bonferroni's, makes adjustments based on the number of comparisons, but it makes adjustments to the test statistic when running the comparisons of two groups. A tool to identify which pairs of means are statistically different. The Fisher's LSD test is basically a set of individual t tests, it is only used as a follow up to ANOVA. Unlike the Bonferroni and 2K, Fisher's LSD does not correct for multiple comparisons.